Hey guys, Joe Tunney here at Infinity of Kirkland in Kirkland, Washington, just outside of Seattle, taking a look at a 2012 Audi Q5 all-wheel drive, just traded in here at Infinity of Kirkland. Now, this one is the 2.0-liter turbo, and believe it or not, they come in two different uh, engine choices, right? They come with a 2.0-liter uh, four-cylinder turbocharged or a V6 engine, and in many ways, it's the four-cylinder that gives you that extra power if uh, you're looking for more passing power or more uh, over the pass type of power. It's actually the four-cylinder that's the way to go, despite the fact that it even gets better gas mileage than its six-cylinder counterpart. Why? Well, this actually has 15 foot-pounds of torque more in the four-cylinder than does the V6. So even though this was rated at 211 horsepower and the V6 is rated at 270 horsepower, Edmunds.com, for example, has this car going from 0 to 60 in just 6.8 seconds, whereas the V6 goes 0 to 60 in 7 seconds flat. Also, the braking distances are shorter on the lighter four-cylinder engine than they are on the heavier six-cylinder engine, and the gas mileage is better. This one enjoys 27 miles per gallon out on the open road and about 22 miles per gallon combined driving. Now, the Audi uh, Q5 is based on the Audi A4 sedan, one of the most popular uh, luxury type of small sedans that there is on the marketplace. And then, of course, Audi's Quattro all-wheel drive is probably the single most recognized all-wheel drive system that there is on the market. Now, this particular car with 12,000 miles is a premium plus. It's a local car. It's loaded. It has those gorgeous LED lights, which have become kind of an Audi uh, hallmark, really. It's uh, one of the most easily recognizable front fascias, front ends of any car on the market. And then also it has things like panorama moonroof, uh, navigation, 18-inch alloy wheels. It comes very well equipped. Premium Plus is the top of the line in the four-cylinder model. In a V6, one of the nice things that you can get are 19-inch wheels, where 18-inch wheels are as big as you're going to find on a four-cylinder. But I, if it was my money and I was buying a Q5, I would personally prefer the four-cylinder. More power, or at least more uh, applied power, better acceleration, better fuel economy, better brakes. That just seems like a better car. And you do save a couple of bucks over the six-cylinder counterparts. Let's take a look at this particular car. It's in fabulous condition. This was just traded in, and uh, you can tell they brought it in completely detailed for us. And we love that, and we're very appreciative of it. Nice chrome roof rack rails, The uh, certainly a very elegant and stylish uh, car. But where Audi really shines is their interiors. Their interiors are simply the single most posh in the category. You just feel like you're in such an expensive car. The steering wheel feels fabulous. The wood is all first class. The fit and finish is quite nice. They're just a really beautiful, elegant, good looking vehicle. Now, back seat room isn't gigantic, but if you're buying a Q5 as opposed to the Q7 or something larger, you know exactly what it is that you're getting. You're getting a, a small crossover sport utility, but it does handle four adults very com uh, comfortably. Three small kids and two adults, yeah, not a problem whatsoever. And then, of course, the trunk, it's a really big trunk, and that's one of the great benefits of a sport utility. You've got a newborn, you want to have a stroller in the back, this is great for that, especially because it has the uh, split folding rear seats. You can fold down just one side, you could run a stroller the long way, have the baby seat on the other side, and still have gobs of room for going to Costco or where, wherever. And then the, uh, if you have more than one kid, you just want to load up with all their gear, this just comes out and you can stack it right to the top. Just a lot of room for something that's really not that big, and it's certainly easy to get around, easy to park, and the handling is superlative. In fact, this car handles like a sports car, which makes all the sense in the world because an A4 is a sports car, and this really is an A4. Let's take a look inside. Now again, this is where Audi really shines. The interiors on these cars are absolutely fantastic. And they have such neat features like panorama moonroof, uh, the great navigation system, dual zone digital climate control, but it's the look, the feel, the leather. Everything is really, really opulent in these Q5s. It's not a ton of money for what you get, but it is a ton of luxury for what you're spending. This particular car, 12,000 miles, it's like a brand new car. It's under full factory warranty from Audi. Four years, 50,000 miles, bumper to bumper warranty. Never been smoked in, never been abused in any way. It just looks great. There's no problem filming a car like this, even though it's just been traded in, because it's not gonna look any better when it gets through the detail shop. This car just looks like brand new. 
If you have any questions about this car at all, please don't hesitate to give me a call. My name's Joe Tunney here at Infinity of Kirkland. You can call me anytime, 425-821-1600, or just drop me an email at joet at infinityofkirkland.com.